Hello everyone, today we delve into the world of vehicle maintenance, focusing on a crucial yet often overlooked component, the O2 sensor. These sensors, also known as oxygen or lambda sensors, are essential for your vehicle's fuel management and emissions system. They monitor the oxygen levels in your vehicle's exhaust stream, keeping your engine running smoothly and efficiently. However, when these sensors fail, they can lead to poor engine performance, decreased fuel economy, and even failed emissions tests. Now you may ask, what exactly causes these sensors to fail? Let's explore. The O2 sensor could fail due to a variety of reasons, but some are more common than others. Firstly, contaminants. These can accumulate on the sensor's electrode over time, forming an insulating layer that prevents accurate readings. This is particularly prevalent in older, high-mileage vehicles, where dirt, oil residue, fuel additives, and other debris from the exhaust gradually coat the sensor. Secondly, thermal shock. The O2 sensors operate at incredibly high temperatures, sometimes reaching up to 900 degrees Fahrenheit. Large fluctuations in this exhaust temperature can cause the internal components of the sensor to experience thermal shock, leading to failure. Thirdly, old age. O2 sensors are designed to operate for between 60,000 to 100,000 miles before they need replacing. As they age, the sensor electrode and heating element degrade, leading to inaccurate signal output. Next, internal failure. Over time, the sensing electrode can stop functioning properly due to contamination buildup or structural deterioration. The heating element that keeps the sensor at operating temperature can also burn out. Wiring issues can also cause O2 sensor failure. Broken wires, loose pin connections, and corroded connectors can lead to false or intermittent sensor readings. Incorrect air-fuel ratios are another cause. Prolonged very rich or very lean conditions can damage the O2 sensors, accelerating contamination buildup and degradation. Oil contamination from sources such as exhaust valve guides and piston rings can allow engine oil to enter the exhaust stream, which can quickly coat the O2 sensor and cause failure. Lastly, improper installation. Not tightening the sensor properly or positioning it where it is vulnerable to impacts can negatively affect its operation. So, as we can see, several factors can lead to the failure of an O2 sensor. But why is it important to address these issues? Addressing O2 sensor failure is not just about avoiding the inconvenience of vehicle breakdowns. It's about ensuring your vehicle performs at its best. A functional O2 sensor maintains optimal fuel economy and it helps your vehicle pass emissions tests, contributing to a cleaner environment. Ignoring a faulty sensor can lead to poor engine performance and increased fuel consumption, essentially burning a hole in your pocket. So remember to keep an eye on your O2 sensor and ensure it's functioning properly. It's essential for your vehicle's health. We hope you found this overview of O2 sensor failure helpful. If you did, why not subscribe to our channel? Here at The Honest Mechanic Colorado, we're all about equipping you with the knowledge to handle your automotive challenges. Every week, we release new content that's tailored to help you, the DIYers. By clicking the subscribe button below, you ensure you don't miss out on any future videos. Thanks for watching and safe driving.